Hello Primary 5, how are you today? Now we are in lesson 2, unit 2, which is the constant and the variable. It's a very easy lesson. What is the constant? What is the variable? The constant is the thing which will be never changed from its name. It's a constant. Constant like what? Like any number, like one, two, three, all are constants. Can't be changed. The two will be came two to the end of the time. And what is a variable? The variable is the thing which can be changed. Like what? Like if we have a mathematical relation, three x equal y. 3x equal y. We have x and y, two samples. The samples are variables, and 3 is the number, it's constant. Of course, all the time the numbers are constants, and the samples are variables. Here, we have question 1. Write down a mathematical relation between x and y. A x is 3 more than y we have x equal x is so x equal 3 more than y meaning y plus 3 x equal y plus 3 here x is x is meaning x equal 5 times y you can write x equal 5 multiplied by y or you can write x equal 5y the multiplication sign you can neglect it and when you see 5y you understand it's 5 times y question c y is 7 less than x y is meaning y equal 7 less than x, it's x minus 7. y equal x minus 7. Easy. Here we have another slide. If the price of a book is 50 LE, the price of x book is y, then write a mathematical relation between x and y. Okay, the price of x box is y. The relation will be what? y equal 50x. y equal 50x. y is the price. The price of book, if x box is the number of books. And y is the total price. And the price of one book is 50. So, to get y, the relation which will give you y, it's 50 multiplied by x, 50 times x, which is 50x. Another question we have. The price of a meal is 30 LE, and 3 LE are added for delivery service. If Muhammad bought x meals, and y is the total price he has to pay. Then write the mathematical relation between x and y. Okay, x meals, the number of meals, and y is the total price, and each meal is 33. Why 33? It's a price 30, but there are 3 pounds and labor service. So you will make y equal 30x plus 3. The 30 is for the meals and plus 3 for the delivery service. Here we have questions. Choose the correct answer. Question A. The perimeter of a square is a P and its side length is X. Then the mathematical relation between P and X is what? We know the square has four equal sides. The perimeter equals side length multiplied by 4. If the side length is x, so the perimeter will be 4 multiplied by x, which is 4x. Question B. If the area of a rectangle is A, its width is W. 
and it's rent 45. Then A, which is area equal what? We know area of rectangle equal length multiplied by width. We have here the length 45. The width is W. The area will be 45 times W, which is 45 W. Okay, question C. The length of two adjacent sides of parallel ram are x and y. So the perimeter will be what? We know the perimeter of parallel ram equal length plus width over the two sides plus multiplied two. The two the two sides are x and y. I will make x plus y multiplied by two, which is two x plus y. Question D. The difference between two numbers is y. Then the greater number will be what? The difference is y. The greater will be what? Think with me. y plus 8 or y minus 8 or 8 minus y or 8y. Here we have the difference. Difference meaning you will use the plus or minus. I can't do multiplication, so I neglect the last with the last choice. And I need the greater number. I can't get the greater using subtraction. Subtraction will make the number smaller. So the answer will be y plus eight. Y plus eight will give you the greater number. I hope you can understand it. See you in the next lesson. Goodbye.